Hello. We'll take a look at our first storm of the year right now. This is Tropical Storm Arthur with the same winds of 50 miles an hour, moving at 23 miles per hour with 1,001 millibars. We're also looking at Cristobal right now. It's a new tropical storm. It's not moving at any miles per hour. It's actually just staying there. 1,000 millibars and 45 miles an hour. We also wanted to tell you about Tropical Depression Bertha. As you can see, here's Dolly. Um, 50 miles per hour went west northwest at 17 miles per hour. Not very big situation. Tropical Storm Faye was located in Galveston, Texas. Depression Edward was also located towards Florida. And Gustav is now our first storm to become subtropical right now. Tropical Storm Hannah could cause flooding towards Louisiana. Here's a system. Here's Hurricane Kyle at 85 miles per hour moving towards the um, Canada and Ocean. Lily is impacting Santo Domenico, Dominican Republic, as it can see. Tropical Storm Isidor was located. And by the way, here is also Josephine. You're watching live hurricane coverage from the Weather Channel, Hurricane Central. It's to be people other than us. Other than as you can see, hello, we are welcome to the Blood Channel. We are now doing her live hurricane coverage as Hurricane Lily moves towards Louisiana. I'm Keith Rushledge. And we're going to cover this storm right now. As you can see, people are already preparing their homes in Louisiana for more damage to come. It is not over yet as Hurricane Lily comes. You know, I never really dealt with a hurricane before. Yeah, so people are trying to evacuate and put their safety plans before Lily comes because Lily is going to be a very big hurricane and when it comes right now it's a category four and people are preparing emergency prep preparedness around us for Louisiana around. Gulf Shores, Alabama heart is now being slammed apart by Hurricane Lily tonight. Um, Grand Isle police are trying to make sure everybody's okay for Hurricane Lily because it's such a big hurricane and people want to be out before it even comes. Here's Hurricane Lily, now a Category 4, moving at north, northwest at 16 miles per hour. Just like Isidore, it was also a Category 4. Now it's moving towards Louisiana as a Category 4. This is why people are so emergency needed. So you see, here's Lily on the radar moving towards that area. As you can just see, that catastrophic movement. These are tornadoes and things. Tornado warning from New Orleans as Lily moves there. You're watching the Weather Channel, Evening Edition Alert System. We wanted to alert you about Hurricane Lily evacuations. If you live in Louisiana and you're watching this, evacuate now. Pause the show and get on the road. Lily's now moving up to... Louisiana even closer now is, is going to hit Thursday and it will dissipate on Friday. Thursday is the day people have to get ready for Lily. Hello, I'm Keith Resters and I'm here with my buddy Dave Swartz and right now we're going to track Hurricane Lily for you as it comes ashore. Lily is still a Category 5, which, I mean 4, which is the same width of 145 miles per hour. Oh, yeah. North-Northwest at 60 miles per hour, as you can see, it's spinning into that Louisiana area right there. It's very scary that people are not still evacuated for this.